hold it. I got you. Okay, vegans, we have a new wheel built up. This is a H-Sun TB14 with a Dura Ace 9000 front hub. It's the uh, HB 9000. And I built it up yesterday myself, three cross, with some old uh, spoke, 72 spoke. I'm gonna put a room tape in there, and I recommend the Velox. Let's do it, let's do it over my shoulder setup. Come on over, come on man. And then we're just gonna start. We're gonna look for the, the valve hole. Now rim tape protects your tube from getting caught by this stuff. All right? And you wanna make sure your rim tape goes across the valve. Where is the valve hole? There's this valve hole. We'll start the valve hole. And we're gonna, there it is. And we're just gonna like put it over the valve hole. And then it's gonna go like that. And we're gonna put it down pretty firmly. And I'm gonna put a tire in here as soon as possible so the tube, the pressure of the tube can push that glue down and set it. If you put rim tape around a tape, a rim, the glue stuff like this, it will get like non-tacky. The air will destroy the glue. So make sure you put the rim tape on and then put a tire and tube on there straight away. Maybe a front say. And we're just gonna go around and I'm gonna push down here and stretch that out. It's like your mum last night. Push it down and stretch her out. And then we're gonna go in like that and that's how we do it, man. We'll make it even so it's not like going up one side or the other. We're just gonna go around. And that's how you do a rim tape. And this will last for years. And I check, every time we get a flat tire, I always check, make sure the rim tape hasn't slipped up around anywhere. And this is perfect. This is 22 mil fat. This is fat. This is mountain bike rim tape for a road. So make sure you get the right size. And you want to go all the way in that bed there. And that's how you do it. And then the last bit, we're just gonna cut that with some scissors and make it flush. And that's how we check it around, make sure it's all all even, and it's pretty good. It looks pretty good, it's a bit high here, so I'll do that last bit again, make sure it's even, OCD style. And this Eddie Merckx here, check out this. This is an Eddie Merckx uh, MXL tubing. With the MXL tubing. And this is the rule set's gonna go on there. Do any questions about veganism or Velox room tape? Let me know down below. And this little plastic thing, I cut it in half in case it because this could strangle a fucking penguin or something. So I'm gonna cut it in half, I'll show you. Here we have an old box section rim, it's an old bulba. We're gonna weigh it. It's a 105 hub. We've got 925. And it is three cross. Got a little Le Monde Reynolds frame there. We've got the latest Dura Ace with a H Sun wheel. 32 spoke, three cross, 847. This wheel cost me 130 bucks spokes and stuff. And it's 139. So for the extra this wheel is worth about 10 bucks. This wheel is worth about 500 bucks. Went shopping for new girlfriend, Coles, got them special. <laughs> Five bucks a kilo. <laughs> Tori's showing me this fig tree, secret location in the garden. Adelaide's so good for figs. He's got rain on, raindrop. Not fully yet.